everyone welcome to my channel my name is Corey today I'm going to end up using this uh, wall it's called a floral garden wall and I got this at the Dollar Tree store and I'm going to be using um, one of these uh, it's a vinyl paper permanent one so I decided I think I want to add this to this so I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to cut this and then I'm going to remove the paper from the back of course to add it to my thing but I'm just going to cut it straight here okay easy to put. <laughs> At least for me it's not. I'm sure it is easy to put on here. But my little sand
not, I'll try to use my little sand block thing, but make it even. It should be okay. Okay. And now what I'm gonna do next, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna use a, a stencil on here. And I decided I wanted to use this stencil right here. It's a rub-on transferred, I mean, not a stencil. A rub-on stencil, which I got this at the Dollar Tree uh, Crafter Square. And I'm going to add, put this right up on here on the center. Okay, I think that looks really pretty with this on there. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and cut this. give it a rest of look. Okay, and I need to get my Mod Podge. Sorry. I'll be right back. Okay. And I'm going to use Mod Podge. And I'm going to use a paintbrush, of course. And first I'm going to start at the bottom here with a little bit of And then I'm going to just use a little bit of cinnamon. And then I'm going to put a little bit of cinnamon on it. And then on this 
going to thread this on here. Just my napkin. See how that gives it a little rustic look? And right here I could add more Mod Podge on there if I want more rust on there. Add a little bit more, not too much on there, of course. I'm just going to put it right there. I'm just going to keep going round on it and just try to get it all the way around. Now what I'm going to do in the back, I'm going to start from the back. I'm going to put a little bit of black uh, uh, paint on there around the edges. And I'm going to be using uh, my black uh, shop paint, my Hello Hobby, which I get this at the Walmart store. I'm just going to pour a little bit on there. I'm not going to use a lot of this. Just and I'm just going to go like around the edges and just around the trims. Around these trims here, I want to have a little black on it. So.
so far. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add a little bit of dab of black here on there. I'm going to put a piece of stagger foam in here. Mm -hmm. Let's see, I want to put some of these firm. Sorry for the camera moving. I'll put some of these firms. But I have some uh, other uh, greenery that I can just use to fill this up. But, yeah, because I think this is just going to cover up my sign. And that's not going to be good at all. I'm going to be able to read it. But it says, okay, farm fresh flowers, seeds, and stems blossom. Okay, and that's it for my DIY for today. So I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. And hit that notification. So you won't miss any of my upcoming videos. And I hope you all have a beautiful day. And thank you for watching my channel. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye. I love you guys all. Take care. Bye-bye.